five typical errors that Vietnamese people make with the f and the p sounds when speaking English. First, saying a p sound when the f sound should be said at the end of a word or before a consonant. So Vietnamese people say cup instead of cuff, up instead of off, and after instead of after. Second, some people cannot correctly say words beginning with fl, and they will say pl or pl instead. So they will say plight or flight instead of flight. Plor or floor instead of floor. And pluent or fluent instead of fluent. Third, people don't say the p sound strong enough at the beginning of words. And they say a sound that sounds like a very weak p or b sound and sometimes even as a f sound. So some Vietnamese people say by instead of pie and bush or fush instead of push. Fourth, some people cannot accurately say the p sound in words beginning with per and pull and they say fur and full instead. So they will say fry instead of pry, fly instead of ply, and problem instead of problem. Finally, the fifth problem is that very often the different ways of spelling the f sound create a problem and Vietnamese people don't know how to say words where they see the ph like in nephew or a gh like in enough, both of which are possible ways to spell the f sound. In this video, we will learn how to say the f and the p sounds well and what the differences are. We will examine how we typically spell words with the f sound. We will practice saying words and sentences with these sounds and we will test your newly acquired skills. So, let's correct these mistakes and start speaking accurate English. Are you with me? Let's go!